please like this video leave a comment and don't forget to share all right welcome to skinny tv on youtube once again the black stars technical advisor mr chris hilton has insisted that coach otto ado is the head of the black stars team he is the head coach so he said a lot about him a lot about um Ole Lekinson, a lot about George Watson, Didi Dramani, and all hot Ghanaians also think about the team whether he is not acting as the technical advisor, but rather maybe as a team manager in there. And a lot we will talk about all here on this channel. As he had an exclusive interview with the Sun. We will talk about that here on this channel. Before then, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, don't forget to smash on that subscribe button, put on the post notification bell, and all for more updates here on this channel. As we know already, Chris Hutton was appointed as the um technical advisor to the head coach that is Otto Ado when Ghana wanted a substantive head coach. Now, after Ghana sacked Milovan Rivak for um you know giving us a abysmal performance in the just ended AFCON, um these four men were chosen as the technical team of the Black Stars, headed by coach Otto Ado. And afterwards, people were saying that Chris Whitting um should have been a head coach for his experience and the whole lot. And he has insisted that coach Otto Ado is the head coach of the Black Stars and that he is fully committed to helping the former Ghana international to succeed when he was speaking with the sun newspaper these were his words that he used um he told the sun that one thing we are very clear on is that he otoado is the head coach and um, he's someone i was aware of as a player and he has a good pedigree he also added that otto is, a, is also a very good coach he would not be employed by Borussia Dortmund if he was not he is responsible for picking the team and the tactics my role is to be a sounding board to give whether advice or whatever advice i can to support him and the rest of the coaching team as best i can and because of my experience i'm confident that i can handle that he also added now his shooting's involvement has been well received in ghana but he also added that most people see it as good um, technical staff as well as Otto. There is George Boatin, whom I know very well and is working at Aston Villa. We have a well established coach, Masu Didi Dramani, um, based in Ghana, and goalkeeping coach Richard Kinson played for Ghana. He ended by saying, Football has changed. A lot of what we are doing is over Zoom or Y Scout with the head coach in Germany and me in England. But we feel there is a really good dynamic there. So these were his actual way saying that he's going to do everything possible to support the current Blasters head coach. That is um Otto Ado, and they are doing very well. So the quartet, as you know already, that's um Otto Ado, Didi Dramani, George Boatin, and Chris Houghton. They ensured Ghana's qualification to the World Cup after being appointed when coach Milovan Ryback was sacked for his abysmal performance in the just ended Afcon in Cameroon. So, guys, this were his actual words, citing that yes, there is no problem in there. He is still acting as the technical advisor and he is going to help Otoado. He is very capable for his pedigree that he is. Yes, he is going to work because if he wasn't capable, maybe Dortmund wouldn't have appointed him. So, let me know what you think about it in the comment section. Subscribe to the channel, put on the bell for more updates here on this channel. This was Kenny TV, and of course, we shall meet later. Please subscribe to the channel and hit on the notification bell for more.